Hey guys, what's up? Walking vlog back and today we're gonna be in Pinheiros. Gonna show you one of the best neighborhoods in this city right after the intro. Hello Bio Nation, we are in Pinheiros today. This is probably my favorite neighborhood in Sao Paulo. If you stick with me, you will understand why. We are at, on Avenida Pedroso de Moraes, or Pedroso de Moraes Avenue. Just to start, uh, Pinheiros starts from Faria Lima Avenue and goes up until uh, Hospital das Clínicas, Clínicas Hospital. As my mother has a, a doctor's appointment there, I thought, why not going to Pinheiros and making a vlog there? So that's what we're gonna do. I'm going to show you Pinheiros entirely. We're gonna walk in zigzag, establishing limits between Avenida Rebouças, Rebouças Avenue, until a street called uh, Cardial Arco Verde, which is also really popular here. So stretch your legs because you guys are gonna walk a lot with me. It starts with the mirrors, check them out. So beautiful. This neighborhood has a lot of culture. A lot of bars, restaurants, art galleries, you're gonna love it. Just rush here. Make sure you guys click on the like button there, okay? Subscribe to the channel. In order to be able to show you the whole extent of Pinheiros, I have divided the place in two parts again. So when you, we go up, remember the topography in Brazil is very hilly. So we, when we go up, guys, uh, you will get to Hospital das Clínicas, as I said. But in the middle, there is an important uh, street called Henrique Schaume. So I'm gonna show you the first part and then we're gonna cross to the other side of Henrique Schaume and film the second part. I'm ready and I'm prepared for this because I have uh, an extra battery here.
what is the best way to exercise uh, and show you my country than that walking vlogs are really good for me and uh, right now it's 12.05 so it's lunch time streets like this oh there is a street fair today there's a farmers market taking place in Pinheiros today I came here yesterday but there wasn't one We'll probably go inside the farmer's market today I'm gonna show you a little bit of what it looks like so they're gonna have a lot of gains with this video So I said I was going to establish rebouças on one side, but actually I'm going to establish Rua dos Pinheiros as one of the reference. Check those two murals, guys. The neighborhood breeds art. Not to mention the bars, the restaurants. There is a mix of tribes, people here. They have German, they have British, they have uh, uh, Spanish people, South Americans, lots, lots of Argentinians, Uruguayans, Chileans. A street market here. Let's 
go inside the street market for you guys to have an idea. cartão no bolso Small street market. But you could have an idea of what it is like. Our idea is to explore the neighborhood of Pinheiro. So let's keep walking.
you will notice that the neighborhood is always expanding you see a lot of construction sites look I just received this more projects in the region So we're gonna go into Rua Cardial Arco Verde and from there we're gonna come back again. Make sure you smash the like button guys. Your participation is essential, don't forget that guys. Cardial is here. I think I'll go one more. For you guys to see the whole neighborhood. Today is busier than yesterday when I came here. This is Brazil and subtitles. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do it. The only channel on YouTube about Brazil where you find a whole range of videos about the country from walking vlogs to bike vlogs to videos about the culture about the history look how nice that building is wanna practice jiu-jitsu guys So the street we are at right now is Simão Álvares. So let's cross. We're crossing Cardial Arco Verde again. <laughs> let's go on to Rua dos Pinheiros. The interesting thing is you have a mix of uh, offices and uh, houses as well and buildings apartment buildings lots of uh, businesses restaurants bars and a lot of noise sometimes right Especially with the motorcycles in São Paulo. I know. Um, I always say positive things about the places that I film, right? Because they have very good things, okay? But I'm gonna say, so far, Pinheiros is my favorite place and you will understand very soon why. Even told Tali last night, let's make an effort 
and uh, move to Pinheiros. Bar LGBT. Teodoro Sampaio now. Oh guys, so many stores and I like this part that has a lot of vegetation so they have some narrow interesting streets like this one you're gonna see on the left and on the right as well, check it out ah. very nice let's take a look at those Guys, I'm taking some pictures. Uh, if you guys want to have access to those pictures, make sure you become a member. Okay? We're gonna do a lot of walking today. Look at that, guys. So nice. It's written in English. Choose to be happy. It's like an alley, right? Oh. This is Simon Alvarez Street, where we are now. Crossing Rua Arthur de Azevedo now. <laughs> so they have lots of bakeries here, bars. Padaria Artesanal, check. 
That would be like homemade bread, homemade bakery, homemade bread bakery. How do you guys say that? I'm gonna leave this written there, okay? Look how many new towers. This is a new tower, guys. That's fantastic. Rua dos Pinheiros, for me, the busiest street so far. Okay. The busiest. Oh, hamburger uh, restaurants. The size of that tower, guys. Tower 2000 is the name, Torre 2000, look at the size. When you come to São Paulo, stay in Pinheiros. You'll find everything you want close to it. Not only the neighborhood is amazing, but it has access to everywhere. From here you can go to Vila Olímpia, Vila Madalena. Moema. No. Access Faria Lima Avenue. Look. How nice. That's a bakery as well, no? A uh, new construction site right there. So what I'm offering you guys here is a complete view of the neighborhood, guys. Complete. Check. German place. Store. Look how nice. So a German place here and a Japanese place here. Fantástica torta da Maria. So that would be translated as the fantastic Maria pie.
as it is Brazil you're gonna have some slopes to go up and down remember the topography here is really hilly oh guys preparing for another tower so it's incredible how this city expands some of you some of you ask me if I'm afraid like this is gonna be like a bubble okay a real estate bubble I really don't believe it check it out there are so many different things here in Brazil compared to what happened to the US with the bubble of 2007 and 2008 starting by the way that um, the banks do business here make loans There's a big Pão de Açúcar supermarket here. It's a, a chain of supermarkets uh, from Rio de Janeiro. From the mega businessman called Abilio Diniz, the late Abilio Diniz. And they are really popular in Sao Paulo as well. Famous, I would say, not popular because they tend to be a little more expensive than the other supermarkets, but you find quality. If you guys want me to make a video about uh, Pão de Açúcar supermarket, leave a comment there. Let me know if you guys want me to do it. I'm going to go inside one of them. I'm going to make a video only to show you Pão de Açúcar, right? Go to the other side. See how busy the neighborhood is. Really busy. Just crossed Teodoro Sampaio again. Gonna go towards uh, Cardial Arco Verde now. Shadow guy. The 
day is amazing people normally ask me about the the weather in Sao Paulo during the winter it's not only cold so sometimes it's cold in the morning and it's warm in the afternoon look at this Academia da Cerveja or the Beer Academy so this morning was quite cold especially inside the house because of the whole night but now it's delicious it's about 24 I guess 24 23 something like this Cardi Arco Verde once again. I hope you guys don't get dizzy. Because we're gonna turn right here on Cardial. any other city there's traffic uh, quarrels right this uh, as any other city there are traffic arguments sometimes Querem Fradic e Coutinho, não. My God, são so nós. This is Fradic e Coutinho, não. Try to cross to the other side.
açaí. Hum, é love açaí. Just love it. Smash the like button, guys. Subscribe to the channel. Don't forget it, please. No other channel will go in a neighborhood in zigzag just to show you everything. So you are in the right place if you want to learn about Brazil. In the right place. More constructions up ahead. And this is just Pinheiros, huh? What you say about the other neighborhoods as well? the best neighborhood so far This is just my opinion. What is yours? Leave a comment there, guys. I want to hear. I want to learn about you. But this is just my opinion. How about yours? What do you think? Is it your favorite so far? Fradique Coutinho Street uh, and this is Arturo Azevedo. Then I go on to Rua dos Pinheiros again. Outstanding neighborhood, guys. Simply outstanding.
Rockware, it's a store. What a beautiful neighborhood. And the weather is helping us a lot. Para Dick Coutinho Subway Station, Yellow Line. And we are on Rua dos Pinheiros again. For me, the busiest street. In the neighborhood is this one. The busiest street is this one. That one is... Avenida Rebouças And if you go up, you end up at the end of Paulista Avenue Look, this is gonna be another building Bio Arc Pinheiros My god, so many towers in the city And the bars, guys, this is a, a wine bar, take a look Consulado da Bahia, Bahia Consulate, look how beautiful it is. So we are on Mateus Grove Street now. É que aqui é tudo muito caro. A woman just passed us by said that everything is really expensive in here. It might be. They might follow uh, the financial condition of those residents. Look how nice, guys. 
This is what I'm talking about. This is a grocery store, believe me. So big. Artur Azevedo once again And we are still on Mateus Gru Oh Gru, I don't know, Mateus Gru Subscribe to the channel because I will keep recording videos like this Pretty soon I'm gonna go to Jardim Paulista which is also beautiful Remember this is a series of walking vlogs in the best neighborhoods of the city of Sao Paulo, okay? Ah, oh, nice building Feature there, guys. Check. Guys, this part is really interesting because Teodoro Sampaio Street, one of the streets we've been crossing a lot, has an elevation. Take a look, it goes above this Mateus Gru where we are now. And then we're gonna be on top there to show you how interesting it is. Check it out. So the street comes from Faria Lima and passes all over the street where we are. And they have a lot of mirrors under the bridge here.
This is Teodoro Sampaio Street, Rua Teodoro Sampaio. We've been working, we've been walking for more than one hour now. The stores uh, pour some perfume, so the street smells really good, guys. Oh, take a look, we are above the other streets, uh, close to it. Check it out. How interesting that is. Look. This street goes above the others, check. Check this out. We, we passed the other one, not this one, and uh, but it's above all the others. Look, look how beautiful. Very nice. People arguing, people complaining, lots of movement. Other construction. Two constructions actually. We're gonna get to Rua Conego Eugenio Leite now. Another important thing I have to say guys, I don't feel tired walking on this neighborhood. I don't feel tired walking in this neighborhood. You know, it's not that hilly, you know, if you go to Jardins, it's crazy. Really crazy, really to, you need to have strong legs for you to be able to explore the neighborhood. Of course I'm gonna make a video there but I'm just telling you already because it's just like this very steep look how nice that apartment is big balcony Like that place here it's called it might be here in Portuguese deve ser aqui because this is a very common expression in Portuguese we say deve ser aqui when we look at the place we're looking for it that's what we say
crossing Arthur Azevedo again. Nice church there. We are still on Rua Cônigo Eugênio Leite. Heading towards Rua dos Pinheiros again. I like to keep crossing the street so that I can show you both sides a complete perspective of the neighborhood POV, right? Point of view Another construction site, guys. Number 100, maybe. Number 100, maybe. Getting to the end of the street, Rua dos Pinheiros, and completing the first part of the neighborhood before Rua Henrique Schaumann, as you can see on the map there. So the first one we have already covered. This is the last street of the first part I established to show you guys. Uh, I'm gonna take two streets on the right. I'm gonna take the second street on the right. And I'm gonna be on Hu and Hick Schaumann. Which is the one dividing the second part of the neighborhood. How do you like so far? How are you enjoying this walking vlog? Leave a comment, 
smash the like button the size of this tower and this one that they're building check my goodness fantastic guys Thank God I'm in shape. Imagine if I weren't. I would be dying now. Oh, check this out. Mm. I think you guys are all hungry watching this video, no? And I haven't eaten yet. Starting to be hungry as well. I think it's time I take the, the street on the right, as I said, right? I think it's about time. So many new buildings, guys. This one is new as well. Another tower right there, take a look. I'm gonna stop counting, it's impossible.
gonna take a right on Cardial Arco Verde, as I was doing, okay? This is Teodoro Sampaio, Rua Teodoro Sampaio now. And you have Henrique Schaumann right there. The most important street, or one of the most important streets in Pinheiros. How nice this street is, full of vegetation, lots of trees, really calm. <clears throat> and the next one might be Cardial Arco Verde. Yeah, it is, Cardial Arco Verde, because there's a cemetery right there. I think I will break this video in two because otherwise it's gonna be too long I'm just going to film the first part of uh, the neighborhood and uh, the second video will come out uh, in another opportunity okay I also don't have legs for such an extension of this video too long for you guys to watch and too tiring, okay? Let me just show you Rua Henrique Schaumann. And we're getting to the end of our video, guys. Thank you very much for being with me up until now. Without you guys, this wouldn't be possible, okay? So this is Rua Henrique Schaumann, guys. This is the one that cuts the neighborhood of, of Pinheiros, as I said. And this is where I had an accident with my bicycle. It was right there, exactly there, across the avenue, across the street, I mean. That's where I had the accident. Small accident, of course, I fell off my bicycle like spider-man falls but i did fall so thank you very much for being with me up until now it means a lot to have you guys here uh, i hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you have smash the like button subscribe to the channel and i will record the second part across the street in another opportunity okay thank you very much bye bye